Welcome to my YouTube channel OS VFX. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to create hot air balloon slide animation in PowerPoint. This is how the slide works. When I click, the balloon will appear and it will show you the six options. This slide is very useful for travel and tourism or you can have your brand display on the the balloon itself so let's see how to create this slide in powerpoint i have created two slides without animation and with animation so let's see how to create this slide now add a new slides and enable the guides by going to the view and go to insert select shapes and select oval shape and draw the oval shape something like this and you can make it align center and align middle remove the outline and right mouse click i'm just going to set edit points and the edit point which is here the below at the bottom select that one and just drag it inside so it will show you something the shape uh, like a leaf okay again right mouse click edit points and select the middle point and you can just increase the size something like this all right then i'm just going to cut this part for that i'm going to insert select shape and draw a rectangle i'll just give some different color and select the there's a leaf shape and then the rectangle go to merge shape and say subtract all right i will just reduce the size maybe this much again go to format align center and align middle or i can just bring it here i'm going to just change the color maybe like uh, orange this is the first one and then i have to just uh, press ctrl d to copy more objects select the object and press ctrl d all right and then give some different color say blue increase the size and just say send to back can you see the shape is forming again press ctrl d give some different color increase the size say send to back all right and then i'm just going to select all group it press ctrl d then rotate just say a flip horizontal and you can bring it here and for this i'm going to ungroup i'm going to give some different color now maybe dark blue maybe red and maybe something uh, purple can you see it's so easy the the shape is almost ready now so i'm going to select all and i will just group it right i'm going to draw the basket now for that go to insert shapes select a rectangle shape maybe this size is enough and then i'm going to draw one more small rectangle which will come here all right and then select shape line just draw the line from this end to that end and one more line just uh, align it properly all right and then everything i'm going to select and group it so you can see your the hot air balloon is ready now i'm going to show you how to create the clouds now for that i go to insert shapes and select uh, circles press ctrl d just you can draw any shape you like all right and then select all the shapes go to merge and say union 
and then you can just go and give maybe white color for the background color I'm just going to change some different color and you can remove outlines or better to keep outlines and then you can add shadow which is the offset top and you can somewhat blur it I'm going to increase the size and press ctrl D I'll make another one maybe in this case I'll just uh, uh, flip vertical and I will further increase this one and just say send to back for this I can just give some small maybe the transparency level should be like this maybe 8% and one more press ctrl D you can yeah for this also you can say send to back all right so this is how you can see the clouds also ready now I'm going to give the animation effect now bring this down till here and then go to animation add animation select line enable the animation pane this instead of going down you can make the effect up can you see it's coming up but it's not coming up full so for that select the the arrow and just up maybe till here all right and go to animation properties you'll make it fast and effect I'll just increase some effect and if you see here this is how it will look like okay and upon uh, and then you can just add the the options so for the options I'm going to select a shape and I'm going to use the a single color which I have used like orange blue green etc so for this is like orange and this is option one and I'm just going to copy these options actually or you can type the options so this is one I'm going to group it same thing press ctrl D this will be two and the color will be blue likewise you can just add the the remaining options as well this is three and the color will be green okay now I'm just going to align it properly it should come here and then for each option I'm going to give animation effect for that animation I will say fly in fly in from I will say from right it's coming from right okay so double click again you can make it fast if you want you can give some bounce effect and that should happen either on click or you can say after previous or with previous so same thing now I want to add the animation so same and I don't want to just uh, do one by one I can just copy the animation select the animation and you can go to animation painter and add it okay click on that again animation painter you can it's there so it's all the animation created so now one two three likewise you can just press ctrl D and you can bring it here and then you can add animation effect from say left so if you see here one two three 
four, five, and six. Just change the color and the numbers. So once you have done, your animation should look something like this. Options are appearing now. So uh, that's it from me, friends. Hope you like this uh, tutorial, and don't forget to subscribe my channel, OS VFX. See you soon with more interesting stuff. Till then, goodbye.